What up Trekkers? Cal from Alleyways Travel here. We are heading to Adelaide for the weekend. The place I grew up, South Australia. Emily's over there. Last minute makeup touches. So we're at the bus stop right now in the middle of Surfers Paradise, waiting for a connection bus to the Gold Coast Airport. While we're at the bus stop waiting, check this out. It might be a bit of a stretch, but that's a, uh, that's a limo. safe and sound. It was just a small two and a half hour flight from where we live on the Gold Coast and Adelaide is as beautiful as ever. It's in the middle of the summer. The heat wave was just over so we just missed that. We didn't come into their record-breaking 46 degrees Celsius days. No, it's just a nice 30 degrees, which is fantastic. We're going to be exploring a little bit of Adelaide. I'm going to teach you guys a little bit about it. I grew up here in the suburbs, the Adelaide Hills and the city. Adelaide is most well known for its festivals, its culture, its old architecture and its wine regions, of course, like the Barossa and McLaren Vale. And we're going to go explore. <music> Adelaide really has been quite incredible. I don't come back as often as I'd like, but Gold Coast is home now. We've seen some great things. Uh, the tourist hotspot of Adelaide, Glenelg, which is right on the beach and filled with beautiful bars, restaurants and festivities. An incredible place to go and see. We are going to hit up the beach and try out some paddle boarding and some snorkeling and some cool stuff as well. It was my first time paddle boarding. Uh, a lot easier than I thought it would be as far as balance, but a lot harder as far as energy. It really took it out of me. I need to get fit. Good fun though, good fun. And Sea Cliff, Brighton, Glenelg, all beautiful beaches. Highly recommend. <laughs> Adelaide was great, but it's been a very big weekend. We finally made it home, very, very tired. So, when we left, when we jumped on the plane two or three days ago, um, I had a small pocket knife attached to my keys, which they wouldn't let us take on the plane, naturally. So they took it off of us, um, and they said, just to hide it outside somewhere, you're only gone for a few days, maybe when you're back, you can find it, so. We hit it under that rock. Hopefully. We hit it under a rock so over there? Okay, well, it's... we're outside the airport now. Emily hit it under a rock. Hopefully, it's still there. <gasps> it's still here. Oh my god. I told you I hit it well. You were like teasing me. Baby, come back. Any kind of could see. Found it! If you liked this video, leave a comment, give it a thumbs up, make sure to subscribe. We'll catch you in the next place. Yeah.